Hey, what is up, you guys, and welcome back to my channel. button comment down below and hit this like button at the end of the video if you do enjoy this video and if it was helpful for you uh yeah with further ado let's just get to the vlog and i'll see you when i'm there hey guys we just got here and they're making me watch a video um it's a how many minute video hi i'm joanna from lisa it's a 11 minute video you have to watch check my vision and everything what they're just whatever i'm gonna hand my mom the camera so she can record for me I need to go to sleep, so you'll see me when I wake up. My eye has been getting very bad. Um, it looks like this right now. I want to go to the ER because they're just going to tell me that I have to wait for my doctor. And it's a Sunday, so they had the office closed today where I got my surgery done. I'm gonna have to wait a few more hours. It's currently 1.30 in the morning. So yeah, I woke up from my nap and then everything was okay except for that little red spot. My eye felt normal, but it didn't look normal. And now it doesn't look normal or feels normal. It hurts. Um, it's really discomforting. So these are the eye drops that I've been putting. Blink tears. And then it comes with, this is like the little bag they gave me with the, and um, it came with all these. I've already used a lot, so, um, and it had one more bottle, but I misplaced this. The other um, eye drop that were similar to this, and yesterday I misplaced this, so I called yesterday and told them that, what was the name of it, so I, if I could buy it in a pharma pharmacy and they told me I could and they gave me the name of it but they gave me the name to the this one to this blue one to this one so it's not the right it wasn't the right one so when I was like hey like I already have those eye drops you gave me the wrong name I would need the name of the other ones um the office was already closed so I literally just have to wait till tomorrow. I don't know what it is you guys. Maybe it was that I went to work and where I work is very dirty or something, but we'll see. This is how the eyes are looking right now. 
they're not as bad as um earlier like last night but we'll see what the doctor says so they did give me my eye drops back the ones i had misplaced um they're the anti antibiotic and i'm supposed to be putting this out four times a day so i just put them on right now and then it did sting a little a little and i haven't put these on since friday night and we're monday morning so basically i was without eye drop for like two days and a little bit but this is how my eye is looking right now um it's not as sensitive to light anymore because there's a light right in front of me and um it's not hurting me anymore yeah so i'm just checking your cornea make sure that everything is good because what well, we did this a few days ago all right so yeah we are going to want to pick up the drops in fact go ahead and open as wide as you can so i know it's tough yeah we need to pick up the drops as far as inflammation when did you when did you uh lose your your medication um friday night okay so it does need some more help with the inflammation last night i was crying like it was nothing like how it is right now yeah 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 no and oh so it's a little bit better today way better like, okay extremely better okay well it's going to be much better once we get control by using anti-inflammatories okay mm -hmm. all right and blank blank okay and you didn't put any drops on your left or your right eye either right obviously you lost mm -hmm. it and just didn't use it all right come on forward okay go ahead and look straight mm -hmm. Look straight. I know it's gonna be bright. Yeah, it just hurts. Yeah, do the best you can. Use them every one to two hours. Pretty. The pretty antibiotic one. The antibiotic, which we're actually going to use it because of its anti-inflammatory properties. We're losing control of the inflammation because we haven't used the drops, right? So we need to make sure that the inflammation is going to go away. But we need to put out the fire, so to speak, and the fire is just inflammation. Okay. So let's tackle that. You know, a day or two is going to work out fine, whatever works best for your schedule, and we'll do it all over again. Okay. okay. But the flap is in position, if that's what you're asking. It doesn't look like it's anything infectious, if that's what okay. you're asking. Okay. But inflammation can be very serious if we don't lose it or if we don't uh, keep track of it. So that's why I want to keep a closer eye on you. Tomorrow, one of two things will happen. It's either going to get better or it's not. If it doesn't get better, we're going to go with some really strong anti-inflammatories. If it does get better, then we can plan out according to what this looks like, all right? Okay, but you're probably gonna be on anti-inflammatories pretty aggressively because we we think of it as a race, right? We didn't go anywhere since Friday, so now we gotta catch up to everybody. Okay. Fair? Okay. Questions okay. for me, guys? I know. All right, let's get you going. Thank you. Uh,